Um, I was shooting my last campaign and we were in this huge big cement structure and I thought how amazing could it be to actually use cement in a collection. So I started thinking about it and um, we decided to approach PPC and um, we were so lucky to have them on board. So then we really literally I started thinking how do I do cement clothes. So my inspiration is about, there's an artist called Kevin Francis Gray, it's this sculpture. So I really love, this is all made out of marble and resin. So the, the idea is that it looks liquid and it's got all these folds and things, but it is completely solid. So what I've then done is decided, okay, so, you know, cement has three phases. It goes from a powder to a liquid to a solid. And how can we portray that within the collection? So we've started off with over here, for instance, all the whites and very soft kind of colors, which represents the powder form. And then when we go into the liquid, which is for me the main inspiration of the, of the whole collection, is we're taking actual physical cement and we're dunking it in fabric and I'm making clothes out of it so that it looks like it's a liquid, kind of a sculpture. And the whole thing for me is doing very sculptural pieces and you kind of, it plays with your senses because it looks all soft and it looks liquid, but it's actually rock hard. So also I kind of want the, the models to walk down the run when you think, is that cement, is that leather, you know, what is it? So we've done great things where we've taken, for instance, here, um, I've made a whole bust out of cement and as the model then walks all of a sudden this moves but that doesn't so you you kind of get that very kind of sculptural feel towards it I'm Jo Burgo, I was born and bred here, so I studied at a place called Lysoff, I've got a degree in fashion, I won a bursary through Our Magazine, um, and that's kind of where my career started in fashion. Uh, I worked a little bit in TV, in the wardrobe department, and I've been running my own label for about three years now. The, the project for me is incredibly exciting and it's such a wonderful, wonderful product to work with. So for me, the whole show is cement, it is from the beginning, so when you get your invite there is a little cement seal on it. Um, the, the graphics are all, you know, pieces of cement. So from there to your goodie bag, to the actual show, which literally uses BBC product in it. Um, we've made the song ourselves. There's little, you know, cuts of cement like being rubbed. Um, we also, we shot a fashion film uh, at the Jupiter factory, the BBC factory. So that's great. So, you know, there's this fashion, you know, you, it's all cement we iterate the whole time from the product to where it's made to its quality. So it's quite a fun, fun thing for me to work with. Okay, over here we're starting off with things like cement bus. So this is something that we cast literally on a dummy and you can wear it. It's all very wearable and it's your little cement top. <laughs> with the soft, you know, having a, making an actual handbag and then using elements of it in cement. So when you walk, it will look like it's a bag and when, uh, you know, upon closer inspection you realize it's actually a little sculpture. lifelike but mannequin -y sculptured effect. So that's why we kind of were inspired to go really full on with the cement effect so we created the silicone 
and we've made sure that um, we've created little moods on the face. You'll see there's so many different looks coming through, so they all have a very distinct individual quality to the makeup. Um, but what we're doing is we're creating kind of Suzanne Haynes, other otherworldly beings, right? They're not models anymore, they're otherworldly. PPC Cement is the biggest cement company. If you think cement, I always thought PPC. So my first gut feel was like, oh, cement, PPC. So if you're going to have that, you know, you got to go there. Suzanne approached us with his vision and creative concept to actually use concrete in her collection for spring and summer. And as PPC, we thought, what a brilliant opportunity for us to use this to actually promote the versatility of concrete. Anyway, this is what the brand has been doing for more than two decades now with our Young Concrete Sculpture Competition, whereby we've been saying it's not about what's inside the bag, but what you can do with what's inside the bag. And we've been actually saying you can be creative with our concrete. I've always wanted to be a sculptor, and I decided to sculpt, you know, for me, kind of sculpture and fashion are the same thing sculpt with fabrics but now, now this time I get to literally sculpt so that was so much fun. Fashion is, is worlds apart from um, you know from designing buildings and architecture but Dan when you get back to it it's all an art uh, you know an architect is an artist in his own right and, uh, and a designer is an artist uh, in their own right and by putting those two mediums together you know it's literally reimagined concrete it's a totally different theme and a totally different medium so you know my, my, my take is, you know, the only thing that's holding us back in terms of what we can do with concrete is our imagination. If you can imagine it, you know, we can, you know, we can do it. So I think that's a, that's a really strong theme that we need to keep pushing and show the world that, uh, you know, we can do it. It shows the creativity of cement and what you can do with cement. It's more than just infrastructure and the dull grey stuff that you can do with cement. It, it gives a whole new dimension of, to creativity and and the sort of things that people can do. So it was absolutely fantastic. I was a little bit worried at one stage, but I'm delighted that uh, she pulled it off.